Okay, so how are we going to do this? Well, a turret run was suggested. Do we want to roll turrets and see what happens? Maybe. That's a good ship. Or like, what's a good weapon? Because we want to do engineer. Oh, let's see, mortar super mod. Mortar, yeah, mortar is good. Do I want to do like pulse then? If I do mortar. Yeah, let's do uh I think I'm gonna do pulse. Okay, we wanted to do shockwave. I really want to do like a whoops, 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 and I'm dying. I always thought these guys were kind of brutal as far as like one of the first enemies you engage with. Because they totally can just melt you in the worst possible way. I don't see engineer here. There it is. Okay, and let's get the turrets down. Okay. I'm going to be in a rough spot, but I'll make it work. Okay, do we want to grab War Machine? Absolutely. So does Nova Drift have an end boss, or is it progressively harder? Uh, if you saw the last run, which I think you were there for that, I hope you were. Uh, the blue boss at wave 100 is the last boss. The difference is, to some degree, uh... I have endless mode on, so you just kind of go, well, properly endlessly. There we go. That's part of the reason why I like Pulse. It's one of the only weapons where you can uh, unupgraded bully things into oblivion. I guess Flak's pretty good, too. There we go. Oh, don't have the dragons just eat him. I think we might be lucky. I'm just gonna fly in circles until they're dead and... Or that happens. Uh, let's see, do we want to get priority zero? I... okay. Uh, let's grab... let's grab some drones just to give me some extra oomph. There's gonna be a story eventually on full release. Oh gosh. I... I know it will probably not happen, but I would love... I would... Ooh, point defense? When a turret is nearby, you heal. I like that. I like that. Let's grab point defense. Give me a little bit of extra support here. I would absolutely adore a, like, really over-the-top story for this game if it were to happen. I think the easiest way to do it uh, would be straight up no story mode. Just have the NPCs say ridiculous things at you. Uh that makes kind of a, a cohesive narrative. Do I want to do rocket drones? They're definitely better than they used to be. Maybe? Otherwise, I don't really like the rest of this. Now, nah, let's save up for reinforced drones, if anything. Ouch. This is a problem. Oh good. Boss is dead. I don't remember those guys exploding into shards. Ow. Okay, we definitely want elegant construction. It, Scorching Wake is actually a little tempting. But construct ma maximum wall, assembly speed, and assembly speed per level, which we desperately need. I gotta get, what the hell? Huh, that's new. It's like an angry cactus man. I really like the enemies here. Like, enemies 2.0 definitely made this game a lot harder, but it's worth it. Self-destruction. When they're destroyed, damaging shockwave. 
There's also shielded constructs, which is maybe good. If I get regeneration, does it screw my constructs over? I forget. Well, we've got two of these. We also look kind of really cool. I know it would be a really cool, like, kind of bonus mod. It would be your your constructs can actually pick up items for you. I think that would be kind of fun. Ooh. Ooh. Don't hug that man. Those are the bad times. Ah, huh, shockwave is weird. Okay, loaded mines. We need mortar, which requires overseer. Mines are deployed high velocity. Detonate low velocity instead of detonating within a trigger radius. Yeah. So, definitely, definitely loaded mines. I don't think I've done loaded mines with shockwave. Whoops, I was pointed the wrong direction because I am a triangle. And it's a little difficult to figure out where the hell that's you know, where the heck I'm pointing sometimes. Eh. Yep. Nope. Still hard. I wish I had a slightly pointier nose. Uh, let's see. Minefield. Uh... I don't think we actually want this. It does... Ooh. That does help, though. Uh, let's see. And I could get self-destruction, but I don't think I want it. Let's grab the shield cooldown. Oops. And yes, I know I need guardian constructs. Unfortunately, I've only seen ally go by, like, once. Which is a bit of a downer. Because I think I had something else that I needed a little bit more. Uh, uh, did we grab overseer? Sure. So now I can at least get three turrets down. I can't do anything, but I'll get to the point where I can do something. Uh, do I even do I even hop in the middle of this? I guess I might as well. Because yeah, these bad boys do a decent chunk of damage. Ooh, dropping a turret inside of him is. Snarly. The more you pick up uh, construct upgrades, the more they show up. Is that actually something uh, kind of confirmed? I remember suggesting that to Chimeric. Um, but it wasn't implemented the last time I was really playing this. Wow, that was painless. But, I mean, that's vaguely have this no ooh, obsession I'd like to grab some other things but we're gonna grab obsession anyway just so I can potentially cheese up some things I believe it's a real thing I hope it is I honestly uh builds that actually recognize what you're trying to build for is really I, I know a lot of people always get like mad at me when I say like you should have more RNG control in roguelikes but I I stand by that uh, apex machinery Construct hull, rate of fire. The oh right. Main main issue with Apex Machinery is the longer construct assembly time is actually problematic. I I don't know. I think right now it could be a problem. Later on, I think that could be really, really good. Uh maximum shields could be good, but let's grab ally. Because that's another source of damage that I can really use. They are not going to want that with Meteor. Truth. Uh, let's see. Advanced Engineering? Yeah. Might as well. Or do we want to grab Counter Artillery? No, let's grab Counter Artillery. Uh, let's see. And we might as well grab Vital Bomb. Wait, 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 wait. 
Can I do Vital Bond with ras Rapid Reconstruction? I, I don't think so. Yeah, I cannot. Yeah, I thought so. Okay. Retribution. Eh. I mean, it's good. Let's grab Volatile Shields. Because that makes my drones uh, explodey. Not that it really matters too much, but... Explodey drones is always kind of satisfying. I remember doing it on a uh, blades run and it being kind of wild It removes the shields entirely. I was just hoping uh, because I don't have Shields on myself. It would be like a workaround, but it doesn't Remember you can drag turrets around too. Wait, what? How? Ow Oh, do they just... Wait, what? Huh. That's a new one. Uh, let's see. Do we want to grab evasion? No, not really. We want nano tech reconstruction. Okay, do we want heavy caliber? Because I don't think rate of fire affects me. Uh... It's kind of tempting. I'm also not sure about efficiency. I'm going to re-roll though because currently it's not what I want. Later it is. Uh, let's grab adaptive reconstruction though. Oh, they're not moving. I think they might have magnetized themselves too much. Uh, let's see. Priority zero. I'm going to grab regen just because. I am... I am a weak and killable boy. Okay. A little too much backseating. I, I know this is the build that you suggested, but let me have some autonomy here. Because otherwise, you might as well just be playing this and I'll just... Uh... Well, I'll do my own thing. Question mark. I appreciate the exuberance. The main problem is just that, like, after a certain point, I no longer get to choose or learn. I'll ask questions if I'm uncertain, because some of the mechanics have changed. And I don't always trust myself to have the same experience, you know, on a year-to-year -year basis. Yeah, this boy ain't, ain't coming with me. Wow. Freaking one-cycled that guy. I'm really curious about, like, double tap, too. Anyway, I'm gonna go Juggernaut. I just need to have a ton of HP here. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to have some trouble. I should invest a little bit more towards Loaded Mines. Currently, they're not a priority for me. Uh, but they are damn strong. Let's go channeling. Because, yeah, we want the Guardian Drones if I can get them. Okay, I'm dying, actually. Let's, uh... Let's chill for a second. Well, that sucks. Apparently those dudes, like, Wild Novas are painful. Let's see, is this the same as 20 minutes ago where you move slower while shooting? No. Ah, I gotta go core shielding, otherwise I'm gonna die. Huh. Shockwaves are interdasting. We wanna we might want to grab like lightning shields and some other things so they come back really quick. Yeah, the only thing that slows you down while shooting is uh is charge shot and 
Rancor, which I do not have. Uh, let's see. Do we want to grab Discord? Roughly, yes, but probably no. I don't know if Velocity helps me in the slightest. Uh, let's... Yeah, do we want to do flash shielding? Because Tempest Break could be really interesting. Maybe. And then Dis Discord is a ton of fun and probably worth pursuing. Uh, here, Nanotech Reconstruction. This is what I was looking for. Oh, wow. I have a lot of mines. I should be more just, like, gung-ho about firing them. Because they do a decent chunk of damage. Wow. Yep, that works. And at some point, I really should give, like, an artifact. Whoa. Next recursive wild mod you choose is gained an additional three times and then banished. I'm gonna grab that. That sounds fun. I don't know what it would be. I'll have to be a little bit more selective about it. Maybe I maybe I should have got uh grabbed Discord. Okay, this is actually a bit of a downside. There's a lot of EXP from enemies getting killed off screen. I'm gonna have to farm for because it's uh Straight up just, like, not visible to me. Oh, shit. You know what I should get? The one that zooms the... The screen out a bunch. Rude dude. Okay. Didn't die. So, could grab Hyper Metabolism. Uh, <laughs> five times. Oh, baby. Uh, we could do Discord. Kind of preemptively. Advanced Engineering or Evolution. I hate to do this, I'm going to Evolution. Shockwave gets really silly with these guys. I haven't really commented on it too much. Ah, shit. How did I take so much damage there? I don't... I don't know. Okay, let's uh try something... Oh, wait. Mortars hurt you? Huh. I didn't know that one, actually. Oh, if you have no stock. That explains it. Huh. I wonder how mortar, mortar mines work with uh, Vortex. It's probably a bad idea for this, though. Like, Pulse is the easy option because it has huge flat damage and works really well with the mortars. Yeah, let's just try that again. I forgot that mortar can hurt you. I guess I will keep that in mind and pay more attention. I almost kind of wish there was an option to just turn that off. Uh, let's see. Let me... Let me just... There we go. Let me just mortar, uh... There we go. Uh... Nope, none of these. There we go. Let me just mortar only when it's available. Because I tend not to be watching the numbers. hits here. Okay, let's start with the allies. There we go. 
Because, yeah, much as I like turrets, allies are maybe a little bit more reliable early. Long term, I don't actually know which one's better. Okay, well, nanotech reconstruction. I don't think I've actually really bothered with the uh, Guardian allies much. I almost always go for the attack ones because of the uh, the ability to clone your weapons. Ooh. Okay, should probably just chill and heal for a second. Otherwise, I'm in trouble. Does not help. There we go. All that's left is Dragon Face. There we go. Okay. Ooh, Spontaneous Generation. That's a huge one. It's not, like, particularly strong, but it synergizes well with drone upgrades. I don't know if you can ever get them so that they don't die. But they definitely last longer with a good drone build. Okay, I take it back. Tur turrets are definitely the stronger early option. Let's see, evasion is good, but not something I'm going to like go running out of the door for. I'm sure it's actually way better than it, I give it credit for, but eh. There we go. A rapid recon uh, construction with some of the other regen wild mods actually can help with that, I think. Huh. Be interesting. I might want to give that a shot. Because I definitely like rapid reconstruction. I The shockwave is good and the shield against structs is solid. Let's see. One of my biggest problems is, especially with drone builds, especially if I'm doing loaded mines, I don't really go too far down any of the durability tree. And I think that's probably a mistake, but rapid reconstruction certainly makes it a little easier. Limits my options, but that doesn't necessarily make it bad. Huh. Maybe not, though. Shockwave actually does a lot more damage than I thought it did. Don't know. Uh, let's grab Elegant Construction. Okay. Point Defense. Guardian. Recover the hull of other nearby damaged constructs while nearby. Yeah, let's grab Guardian while we're here. That'll hopefully keep my uh, turrets up. We'll be streaming again tomorrow. Yep. Absolutely. Nope. Uh, let's see. Let's see. There's Revelation, which is fine. But let's grab Channeling. We need core, core Shielding. My maximum HP is abysmally low. I don't necessarily know what I'm going to be playing, is the one thing I will say. Because that changes pretty dramatically based on uh, my whims. So, like, today I almost played Creeper World instead of uh, Nova Drifts. I don't know which one would have been better, but I put it up to a vote and people said, Nope, play this. And I was like, alright, cool. Works for me. I'd like to be more consistent with that, but there's just too many games. It's very hard to pick one. Does mean I don't master them, which is, I think, maybe a bit of a downside sometimes, because I would love to be, like, really good at certain games. But also, I recognize that that's kind of a fool's venture as I get older. You know, mastery is ephemeral. And then you step away for a while. Okay. 
So we don't have the drones yet, but at least I can attack. And do a decent chunk of damage. I think the drones still do... Mo uh, well, I don't know if it does more. It definitely does a ton. Alright. Then I guess let's just chill. Let's see. Taking you're not much of a fan of FPS games. Uh, depends. I'm a fan of first person shooters when it's certain types of games. I guess is the easiest way to put it. So like boomer shooters have been kind of like a really cool genre for me because it's finally shooters that I'm interested in. Competitive shooters, not so much so. I played a ton of Battlefield 21, uh, 21, 2142? Not the recent one, the old one. Uh, I played a ton of that when I was younger. That was very much my jam. And I will con consistently talk about it being probably peak FPS for me. I don't actually know if it was as good as I think it was, but I loved it. Uh, let's see. Five levels, lose reload. That's tough. Do we want to grab shield and constructs? If I want to go down that direction. Yeah, you know what? We'll do it. Shockwave is, is too strong. But I think I might want to go like heavy lightning shields. Uh, so I lose them and they come back for the big explosions. Oh yeah, wouldn't get it until I get drones. You know, I kind of totally forgot about that. It's a bit of a shame my uh, little guys don't have shields now I'm thinking about it, but whatever. Overseer decoy signal. Huh. That's kind of good, actually. I don't know if it's actually worth it, though. Let's go regen, though, because I don't have any shields and I don't have drones to protect me. Oh, well. We're early enough in the game that I don't think that's going to kill me. It definitely was a mistake, but it's probably not a fatal one. Whoa. Holy shit, that actually almost killed me. Ah, <laughs> damn. Uh, but with the regen... Oh, interesting, does the regen speed actually affect? Oops. Okay, now... Whoops. Now can I pull these guys together? Oh, do I just have to fly through them? Echo Strike. Blast Radius. Echo Strike seems really good. I want to drag these guys closer together. No, it looks like I can just push into them is, I think, the real answer. It's not that I drag them to me, I can just... Yeah, you can lightly push them around. That's how they work. Okay. Now let's see if my... Yeah, I think I do regenerate harder sandwiched between these guys. The only immediate problem is I don't get any EXP for sitting around in between dudes. But yeah, this this little fight, fight fortress should work really well. Uh, let's grab Overseer so I stop attacking. Yeah. So it's definitely, you don't drag them, you pull them. Or not pull them, you push them. Brain. Brain ain't here. Today was a long day. I should probably not be there while that's going on. Because that's a ton of damage. Speaking of triple turret trouble. Yup. Freaking tons of damage. Okay, meta charge. Oh, interesting. Sure. 
There's also Maelstrom. Well, your shield protects you. You're reefed in a Maelstrom that pushes... Wait. I think I have to grab this. That's ultra rare. I don't know what that does for my dudes. It won't work. It's not on you. Ah, damn. I was really hoping all of my enemies would become Maelstroms and it would be wild. But alas... I'm so glad these guys actually focus on boxes. They used to not, and it was kind of weird and bad. I wish Chimeric was more, more willing to let me break this game. It's already pretty breakable, but I want more break. I want Goofy. It is still pretty Goofy. Uh, yeah, we should probably actually start going down the priority zero line. Now I'm thinking about it. Way too strong if it did. Oh, but it would be so good. Okay. Lost my shields. It's fine. I'll lose an upgrade for some science. Need more drones. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna go hull strength. I need the durability. Didn't mean to split them apart a little, but it's fine. Okay, let's grab that EXP. Scoot back. Okay. I'll just make a little fight fortress. Main problem is I'm just losing a lot of EXP as I'm hiding in there. Uh, let's see. Do we want Juggernaut? Yeah. I'm just going to continuously try and guarantee I have so much HP that I don't just get salvoed to death. And then all I have to do is uh, the retreat back to the Fortress of Helitude. Okay. I kind of want to make sure that this guy is pointed not at friends. Shit. That's probably going to melt him. Yep, there they go. Tough boss. Easier with loaded mines, but it's okay. We still do a ton of damage. Rude. At least Shockwave kind of works out really well here. Don't kill me, train. You're my friend. Uh, let's see. These are tough. Tactical Link is pretty good. I want the other one. But I'll grab it anyway. Okay, get a bit of healing. But let's go over here. Do you have two turrets here? Or I have no idea. Yeah, I do. There's just a lot of a lot of aura going on. And it's a little murky. Ow. There we go. Train. Train EXP. No. Don't you forsake me. Okay. Well, we're mostly chilling. And we're doing a decent job of just ruining things. I think next order of business, I think I'll skip Loaded Mines. Ooh, Support Specialist. Ah, this is tough. The speed and the rate of fire is tempting. The loss of... That's... Hmm... Because that's going to cost me what? How many 
Yeah. Combine standard and advanced construct limits. That's tough. Yeah, overclock I think might be better. Especially if I can get these boyos. Oh my god, that really is quick. A little tough separating these guys out. Or not separating them out, bringing them together again. Damn it. I was too, bu too busy building the Fortress of Fight to notice that my HP was burning. I was kind of hoping they'd kill those things before they killed me, but alas, alas, my reflexes are not great. It is 11 p.m. for me. Damn. All right, I think that's going to be it for me. I realize that I've only been playing for uh, a little over an hour and a half on Nova Drift, but my voice is dying, and I've got to finish that Steam sale video uh, tomorrow morning, and I don't want to be like a total toad. As uh, you definitely can tell, my voice has changed over the course of this. This is fun, though. I will try and play some more Nova Drift over the next couple of days. It remains one of my favorite games of all time. And it's nice to come back to it and like really engage with it in a way that I don't think I had truly appreciated before. Now that I've played all these bullet heavens. And so specifically, uh, playing this again is, is real refreshing because of the sheer build variety. And we'll definitely give the turret build another shot again. But for now, thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you next time. For now.